Hello beautiful people and welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time watching, I'm Sheree. Welcome. If you happen to be returning, you are truly appreciated. Thank you so much and welcome back. Here on this channel, I do cover fashion, beauty, luxury, and lifestyle. So if you like any of those things or all of those things, go ahead and consider hitting the subscribe button. Don't stop there. Hit the notification bell. It will alert you every single time there is a video placed on this channel. And for some reason, I don't know why, I just feel like I have lipstick on my teeth. You guys, hold that thought one quick second. <laughs> you know how you just feel like, do I have lipstick on my teeth? I don't wanna record the whole video, you guys, and then I have to redo it because I have lipstick on my teeth. So anyways, I am here to share with you a Chanel fragrance, 10 Chanel fragrances to be exact. 10 Chanel fragrances that I think would be amazing from transitioning into fall from summer. I told you I'm going to be doing a lot of transitional fragrances from fall or from summer to fall, from fall to winter, because right now it's not really that cold here. So I'm not reaching for the heavy, heavy hitters, but these are ones that I feel can be worn year round or they're perfect for the cool temperatures and the temperatures dropping. So if you want to hear what they are, please continue to watch. So coming in no particular order, I'm just grabbing and going. And of course, I'm going to start with the iconic classic itself. I just picked up a fresh new bottle of Coco Mademoiselle. This this is beautiful year round. This is, you know, classy, sophisticated, elegant. It is Chanel Zuolini. I say more. Yes, it is very popular and that is with good reason. I believe this was said to be one of the most popular fragrances worn by women ever. And so, like I said, it's with good reason, you guys. This can get worn to the office, date night, day date, night date, brunch, you know, church, wherever. If you're looking for a signature scent and you just want a one and done, Chanel, Coco, Mademoiselle would be the way to go. Now, I love them all. I prefer for date night, of course, Coco, Mademoiselle, Intense. This one here to me just has a little bit more tonka bean. Uh, the patchouli is not as sharp or as strong. And then it definitely has a little bit more vanilla, making it to be, in my opinion, a little bit more date night-esque, a little bit more sweet, a little bit more sensual. And I'm all about a good sexy date night. So this would be the one that I would probably wear on date night, but definitely church, girls brunch, anytime, anywhere, any place, just wanting to feel rich, sophisticated, elegant. I'm reaching for, you know, Chanel Coco Mademoiselle. Also, also because I said I am a lover, here is Chanel Coco Mademoiselle Le Breve. And this is set to be the bedtime night scent. Now, if you were thinking, I don't really like the patchouli note inside of Coco Mademoiselle. It's very sharp, it's very strong, it's very prominent. This would be the way to go. This one here doesn't have the best longevity though, but if you spray your clothes, you can get a good three and a half, almost four hours out of it. I have gotten that from this before. I use this when I go to bed and I wanna feel bougie and fancy. I reach down and I put my Chanel Coco Mademoiselle Do Not Disturb on, spray this in my sheets and in my pillowcase, and then I go ahead and I douse myself in it. I jump in my silk pajamas and I get my bougie dreams on okay so this would be a great way to go as well I move on another one that I really love is Chanel Chance this one is warm it's a warm spicy I used to wear this a lot when I worked in the office and I would be you know driving into work I'd have the collar button-up shirt I have my bracelets my rings my nails really short because I was always typing um this is a girl that I wanted to be very classy very sophisticated but you know more of a um put together button-up type person button up type gal that's the vibe that this fragrance gives here this is like I said a warm spicy it's definitely um, to me I wouldn't wear this on a date night it doesn't give me date night vibes it gives me more put together type of vibes uh, chic classy uh, know where I'm going head on straight pay my bills on time you know what I mean I have no time for foolishness I'm almost kind of like a no-nonsense kind of girl I'm almost one of those that's what this is giving me so this right here is Chanel Chance let me give you a few of the notes inside jasmine pink pepper vanilla iris this right here you cannot go wrong especially if you're looking for a work scent I will have everything linked in the description box below but you guys definitely if you haven't give Chanel Chance a try it is really good this is the EDP and like I said everything will be linked in the description box below I move on this one here is Chanel allure sensual and this was really good this is very sexy perfect for date night perfect to just put on and stay in the house and cuddle and chill netflix and chill hulu and chill okay apple tv did you guys know they had apple tv i had no idea anyways i got it now but apple tv and you have some good shows on apple tv oh my gosh we're watching this a quick 2.5 uh, do you mind okay 
we are watching this new one on oh my god what's the name of it i don't know the name but i'm gonna find the name and i'm gonna place it on the screen you guys it is so good it's with um reese witherspoon and jennifer aniston aniston As jennifer aniston you know the girl from friends her and reese witherspoon it's so good um yeah you got to check it out if you haven't and you need good tv to watch anyways back to the fragrance this one here is sexy it's a warm spicy bergamot mandarin pink pepper jasmine rose Oh my gosh, it's good. This is really good. Really nice for a nice sexy date night. You're gonna go get that pumpkin spice latte. Girl, what are you wearing? Oh, nothing. I just have on Chanel Allure Sensual. I move on. Now this sparkling effervescent beautiful fragrance is amazing. This one here is Chanel 1957. This is from the Les Exclusive line and I really love this. This one has kind of a disappearing act. It gets on the body. You don't think it's there but it really is there. You get tons of compliments from it and you're like, oh, I couldn't smell it. But then if you pick up your arm and start like moving and talking with your hands and stuff it'll come it'll disappear and it'll come back but it is a really good fragrance a few of the notes inside of this one you guys is vanilla honey cedar uh pink pepper coriander seeds it is a beautiful white floral um type of fragrance it is kind of aldehyde ish i will say that as well but it's really really good think of this for church for brunch for hanging out with the girls if you just wanted to you know maybe take a day to yourself a lot of people are doing solo dates solo you know dinners solo movies whatever the case might be this is something that you will go down and get a whiff of yourself and you're like oh my god it's very pleasant it's very pretty it's a very pretty pleasant but still sophisticated classy woman chic type fragrance i would say that is 1950 um because it does seep so down into the skin it's almost like a skin scent but not but it sits very very close to the skin i move on if you have 1957 put a gold star in the comment section below because i like to know how many people have tried this it is really really good and i don't hear a lot about it i move on and this one right here is giving honey okay this right here is cremandal by chanel exclusive dolly pull up a chair let's talk you guys this right here is so good i think this is the one that my guy doesn't like i think i put this on in the car and he told me i suffocated him like why did i spray so much what is wrong with me what am i going through in my life <laughs> I think this is the one. This is very long lasting. If you get this on your skin, your clothes, your hair, it is not going nowhere. Okay. It will be there for days. It's, yep, this is it. Oh my gosh. So we were taking, oh my God, another quick 2.5. So I got invited to a Chanel event and I wanted to see if I really wanted to purchase this because this was before I had it. So um, I was like, okay, well, I have tons of samples. So I'm like, I'm going to wear the sample to just see how I really like it, wear it out, play with it, see how it's going to be. And so I did kind of spray heavy, but you guys, there were samples. I really didn't know how much I was really spraying. I guess after I went through a whole bottle of one and half of the other one, I should have known, but I really didn't. So I had sprayed everything. And then we got in the car and we got ready to drive there. And my guy had like a face, like, like a... And I was like, what's wrong with you? And he was like, what, what are you doing? I'm like, what do you mean? He goes, how much of that fragrance did you spray? <laughs> it's like, why are you mad? You know, like, what is what is good? Why are you mad? He was like, it's almost like you sprayed the entire bottle. I, I can't smell anything else but your fragrance. You're suffocating me in the car with that fragrance. I'm like, well, let down the windows. I didn't know, but you guys, in all honesty, I really oversprayed too much. You don't need a lot of this at all. It is very potent. It is very long lasting. It is very prominent. It is very strong. Do you get what I mean? This one right here can get the job done like i said man woman boy child human can pull up and rock this fragrance you guys it does have benzoin in it it has patchouli it has frankincense you know what i mean so those are some really strong notes it's a warm spicy it's more of an oriental type fragrance um like i said very long lasting my guy really hates when i wear this but i absolutely love it so i bought it i move on this is my boss fragrance if somebody say get out that fragrance that makes you feel confident that makes you feel strong that makes you feel like you can do it all tell me i can't because i know i can tell me i can't that gets my juices going to let you know that i can this is that fragrance for me this is coco this is just the parfum um the oh parfum um of chanel and it's really good it's clove it's leather i spoke to you guys about this one peach sandalwood tonka bean um, this is what I wear like a mock black turtleneck, maybe cashmere, some gold hoop earrings, very classy, not too big, but a nice size, maybe a nice, you know, blazer on top, some cute fitted slacks tailored and tapered okay high-waisted of course a nice you know boot where the heel is not a kitten heel you guys i'm doing a little bit above a kitten heel with this outfit and a nice um brown like 
leather blazer or some type of material blazer not like really brown more like a camel color camel and black look so good together almost like the color of this bottle that's what the look is giving me nice manicured nails just a boss chic woman if you're looking for that type of girl that type of fragrance that type of woman this is the way to go this is coco oh parfum i move on I love talking about Chanel, it makes me so excited. Okay, um, of course, we could not even go anywhere without the classic. You guys, this is a lot. I know, I know it's not for everybody. I'm gonna be completely honest with you. Come on, girl to girl, guy to guy, friend to friend. Let's just have a quick talk. I initially said I will never own this and never put it in my collection and here's what happened. And for those of you that have been here for a while, you already know what happened. But those of you that don't, because some of you are new, I may tell you. So I, you know, I don't collect fragrances. I am a lover of fragrances. So if I buy it and bring it in my collection, that means I loved it, right? Now for this particular one here, for Chanel fragrances, I'm a Chanel collector. I love Chanel, 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 Chanel. Um, we are gross. So anyways, um, I didn't feel complete without having number five in my life, to just be completely honest. And I was at an event and I was talking to the gal and the guys and they were like, yeah, you, you know, you kind of really want to have, and I said, okay, just give me a small bottle. And so I started playing with it. And in the real cold, cold weather, it's really good. Now it's not a favorite. I don't reach for it all the time. There is a time and place when I just feel like being that woman. And I go, what did you sleep in? I slept in nothing but Chanel number five. Every now and then, every now and then, every now and then. It's iconic, it's classic. We know who was said to have worn this, you guys. It's Neroli, Ylang Ylang. It's got bergamot peach. This has got some everything in it, okay? Um, down in the base, you got some Mayroll, sandalwood, vetiver, moss, patchouli, bourbon. It is everything um, in this fragrance. It's been around since when? Like 1921, 1920, 1921? And it's a lot. I would never overspray this. This is one fragrance I don't have to overspray. Maybe three, and I'm done. One, two, and then shh, douse me at the top and I'm I'm done I'm done it's very strong but it's definitely it could be worn year round but I really reach for it around Christmas time the holidays it just makes me feel rich and fancy and I love going to like rich hotels where they have like dark furniture or dark woods and old world Hollywood and I wear this kind of stuff and I walk in and I just feel so regal and rich and fancy like I'm living my best life like my whole life I wanted to be this woman and the woman that I wanted to be I am and she is her and we are Chanel number five I move on. You know she was gonna be in here, okay? You knew she was gonna be in here. Hey girl, hey. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is one of my absolute, absolute, absolute favorite, favorite fragrances from Chanel's line, her designer line, regular line, whatever you wanna call it. This is one of my absolute favorites from Chanel. This is Coco Noir. And I absolutely love this fragrance. This is like me in a bottle, like seriously. This is me in a bottle. Go a little bit of white, you know what I mean? Sleek packaging, come through every time, sophisticated, elegant. You can't be replaced, it can't be denied, it can't be duplicated. This is one of a kind, bars, okay? Bars, yes, she's a rapper, hello? <laughs> yes, she's a rapper, you guys. This right here can get it. This is absolutely amazing. Beautiful, classy, sophisticated, elegant, a boss woman on the move who knows what she wants, who's not afraid of hard work, who goes after every single thing she wants that her heart is desiring and she gets it. Yes, because she is not afraid to put in the work. This lady will give another woman a compliment. This lady will fix another woman's crown. This woman will tell another woman how she did it so that she can do it too. This woman is not afraid to sit at the table that she is not the head of. This is a woman that can appreciate everyone. This is a woman who wants us all to win. Okay, this woman is she, she is I, I am her. We are Coco Noir. I'm just saying, few of the keynotes inside of this fragrance, you guys, I get so excited. Few of the keynotes inside of this fragrance, it is a very warm fragrance. I would say it's an oriental fragrance that I would say, you know, it's a very contemporary fragrance, modern fragrance, I would say. It has grapefruit, may rose, it has floral, tonka bean, patchouli. This is a fragrance just after my own heart. I absolutely love this. Hands down, this is one of my favorite fragrances by Chanel, as I mentioned. I move on. And that is it. Those are the 10 fragrances that I wanted to share with you that I think would be perfect for wearing right now. Like I said, you can wear fragrances whenever you want. Wear them year round. Those are the ones that I'm recommending heading over into fall. Like I said, spray what you want, when you want, and spray as much of it as you want. It is your fragrance. Thank you so much for watching this video. Share it with a friend, tell a friend. Come over and hit the follow button on Instagram and I will see you beautiful souls in the next one. Until next time, you know the drill. Be blessed, stay fit, and definitely stay fabulous, darlings. Thanks for watching. Bye.